right, Patrick, and they're concerned about the statistics, all of them, nearly all of them, including the number of COVID tests coming back at testing sites like this, are all going up. Milwaukee's health commissioner warned that could mean a reopening rollback. In the last few weeks, Milwaukee County has seen a trend that's troubling health officials. The average number of new COVID cases is up from 78 on March 1st to 112 Thursday. Our county, our state, and many other states are beginning to see increases in cases as well. And this is due to a loosening of precautions paired with the contagiousness of the new variants. Those new variants include the highly contagious Brazilian strain reported in Ozaukee County just last week. That has Milwaukee's Health Commissioner Kirsten Johnson issuing a new warning. Unless there are changes, the health department will be issuing a new order in the coming weeks reimposing restrictions that were eased just a week and a half ago. A step back in Milwaukee's health order could lower capacity at bars and restaurants without approved safety plans. Fewer people would be allowed inside museums and theaters. The impact could stretch across hotels, youth programs, and child care facilities as well. Health officials say vaccines will be key to prevent more restrictions and a possible third wave of infections. There are warning signs that, that we're seeing right now, and that's why getting vaccinated and continuing to take precautions for the time being uh, is what's so important. Ben, do we know if a potential rollback could impact Milwaukee Public Schools plan to reopen? Well, the health department says that it would not. MPS has an approved safety plan and that would not change with a new health order. What could change is school sporting events. A new health order rollback uh, would limit capacity or limit it more at indoor and outdoor sporting events, Patrick.